Hey everyone, today we are back with a property maintenance series on the Xbox One. It's Thanksgiving morning and we just got four and a half inches of snow. It's time to go plowing the top in the truck and go over to the shop. Now it does look like the town plows have not come out. It is a holiday and I don't expect the roads to get cleaned up. This will be our first time snow plowing here on the Xbox One. I am really excited for it. We have a Seasons mod, we have the Snow Everywhere mod, along with the TLX 2020 and the 8 foot straight blade plow. Now there is a full mods list up on my website if you guys would really like to go check it on out. And as we're turning in here, wow, sliding 3-4 feet though, this will be a slippery day here for us. The temperature is around only 25 degrees. Now I really do like the NMC truck, 4x4 was great but now it's time to get into the work truck. I think we'll run our new uh, work truck here. This is the TLX 2020 stainless steel 8.5 uh, straight pusher on the front and we do have a light bar on this as well. Now today we do have just about, I think it's a dozen driveways, a few commercial and the rest are residential but before we go do that I really want to get our shop plowed out because later on this week we'll be doing some work here and when it uh, freezes up we won't be able to get it cleared. I'm really excited to be back here on the Xbox doing some more videos for you guys here. It's a very fun series and it's a kind of a fun challenge as well at the same time. Now I have gotten quite a few requests to do some snow plowing videos and I do recommend uh, to those that are on the uh, consoles to really only have one layer of snow. I found that the one layer works out really well with this uh, plow. If you have two layers it really just doesn't want to push the snow but you guys can see we do have the new dumb truck here. We did recently pick that up. I do recommend you go check out the playlist uh, to get all caught up here with the proper maintenance series. Now this TLX is a regular cab long bed here. We do have an 8 foot bed on it which is pretty helpful and I really do like the maneuverability here on it but that LED uh, light bar up top is pretty sweet. Probably 4 or 5 pushes here and we're good to go. And if you guys do enjoy today's video here, please smash the like button. It's much appreciated as it does help out with the YouTube algorithms. I do have some pretty big projects here in the works. Some huge announcements coming within the next uh, few weeks here. And I'm really, really excited. And then uh, we'll be getting back into live streaming. Now I think we'll be doing some streaming of some snow plowing live where you guys uh, can come in game and help on out. So far, I'm actually pretty surprised here doing a really good job. Now, we are plowing on gravel at the moment. Really no problem. Usually, you're kind of pushing gravel all over the lot. But it looks like it's floating above it pretty good. And that must mean the ground's frozen as well. And I do hope everyone does have a great and safe Thanksgiving. I really do uh, appreciate all of your support over the years and including 2020. It's been a very unique year and I've uh, really been enjoying uploading farms and videos. So I really do appreciate it and I'm really thankful for all of your support. But I can't wait to go get some turkey after doing some plowing here with the family. It's always a fun time to eat turkey. All the gravy on all the sides to Thanksgiving and to that Thanksgiving meal here. But you guys can see putting in that work probably another pass or two and we are good to go here. So I think we'll first do a few residentials and we do actually have a restaurant to do in a motel. We got to get both those plowed out soon. Since it is Thanksgiving, I did not want to call up our worker. Since it is a holiday, I thought that we'll just give him the day off. We don't have too much to do uh, plowing for today, but uh, we do have a lot more plowing counts here, which is pretty exciting. But I think that's pretty much it here. We do have a little bit at the entrance, which we could get a little bit later on. But up first, we'll be doing this blue house in the driveway is around the other side. Now, I am a huge fan of snow plowing. It's a lot of fun. I've actually gone out in real life with plow trucks, and I will have to say it's a pretty fun experience. Uh, to be pushing snow hours in a power stroke, a regular cab long bed. And I think these trucks are just the way to go uh, for snow plowing. They're really maneuverable and they are great visibility. And that's kind of one of the reasons why I didn't want to take the dumb truck. It's just a little bit too big and it's just kind of hard to see out of it as well. But you guys can see scraped in the ground pretty good here. Four and a half inches is a pretty decent amount of snow. Now, I don't really remember the last time I got snow on Thanksgiving, so I thought this would be such a cool idea to do. And you guys uh, maybe have snow so let me know down below if you've ever gotten snow on Thanksgiving. 
Now, if you guys haven't already, I do uh, recommend you guys go check me out over on Instagram. I am posting every single day over there uh, some pretty cool sneak peeks and updates about the channel. I'm really trying to give you guys as much content as possible, and I'm really excited for the next a few announcements that will be coming. And I do have a full detailed mods list on my website, like always, and you guys have been liking that. But up next, we'll be doing this drive here, this uh, kind of Baxter restaurant, and then we'll be doing the restaurant there. But yeah, it definitely looks like the town plows won't be coming out here. They'll be home with their families, and that's no problem here. Now, I'm not seeing much traffic on the roadways as well, uh, so that probably means that everyone's just home and enjoying uh, their great holiday. Get turn around here now usually they don't allow you to push the snow into the street but we are kind of pushing it across the street here but this tox is just a great uh vehicle we're making pretty good progress here and like i did touch upon having uh, just that single snow layer really does help out really do recommend that uh, to all of you guys here but it looks like the diner doesn't need to be plowed that's the uh, town road here but we do have this parking lot it is a pretty big parking lot as well and i think the v plows would have been pretty cool i'm not sure if we could get a v plow though i mean that would be pretty handy now with this plow truck you guys can see we do have a bed cover and that means we don't have to actually kind of shovel out the bed here every snowfall and that's really helpful saves us a lot of time now with all my videos, I am trying to be as realistic as possible, we'll give you guys some great entertainment and uh, just have a great time doing it and you guys can see really am excited though. Now hopefully we get snow on Christmas now, that definitely has to be happening if we get snow on Thanksgiving here, but we'll go out uh, with the kiddos later and make some uh, snowmen, but I, I think that's probably kind of the most fun about snow, you get to go out, go sledding, I remember those good old days of sledding down the big steep hills and racing each other, that was always a lot of fun here but you guys since he's making pretty good headway there is actually quite a lot of people at the restaurant sometimes it's a family tradition uh, to meet up at a restaurant or kind of whatever and that is pretty awesome here but the plow truck has been doing a good job really no problems with it first time plowing as well that's always a big unknown uh, when you're using the truck for the first time but I think that's pretty much it we do have a few more residential and then we'll end with a hotel up next, we do have this driveway here. It's going to be a little steep. Now, one thing I have noticed, uh, the plow sometimes does not want to go into float mode. So we pretty much have to uh, put it to its lowest setting here, pushing a lot of snow. This is a kind of a driveway that's in not the best of shape. And if we aren't too careful, we'll probably just tear up the uh, concrete and the asphalt. Let's see, get a little bit of traction. 4x4 four four activated. No problem. Just look at that push in snow. It is tricky sometimes. And with plow trucks, we do have chains, we do have straps, and I think a plow truck needs a winch as well, but we do not have one. But so far today, we haven't gotten stuck, and that's always helpful as we're just trying to go out and make a little bit of money and uh, get all these driveways cleared. So we are coming up here on the motel. I think it's our next, right? Yeah, here it is. Now, this is always tricky. It's just kind of where do you push all the snow? So we'll have to give it our best here. And I think that we could kind of push it up against it. So the story with this one is the owner lives in this red house and owns a motel. So he kind of owns it and also lives here at the same time, which is pretty neat. And not too bad of a job here for plowing. And I think we're going to have to just make a pile here and push it all onto the grass. Now, sometimes for a snow plowing, you do just have to find the best areas to push all the snow, and that does take a little bit of practice and a little bit of time, uh, but snow plowing is a ton of fun. Now, we will be back snow plowing on the PC soon as well. We'll be doing a lot of content over there, and we will be doing some multiplayer as well, which should be awesome. Let's see, let's see. We're going to have a little bit of it kind of spill on out there of the wind road. It's going to take a try or two, but so far, uh, not too bad. Now, if you do have any cool ideas here with a proper maintenance series, let me know. Now, what I'm thinking, guys, if the ground is not frozen, we will be continuing to do jobs here. I really have a lot of jobs lined up, lots of cool video ideas, and I definitely want to continue to do them. So even though we're getting snow today, doesn't mean that we are kind of out of work here because we have so much jobs planned. I can't wait for them as well, and we'll be putting this truck to work. We'll be using that new dump truck soon as well, but there we go. We have the motel completely plowed out. We have a little bit to do on the other side. I'm just kind of pushing it here a little bit of just tidying up work But what I'm thinking is instead of taking our NMC home. Why don't we just go home with this? I think that means we'll get home quicker and we'll get to that turkey 
And let me know down below in the comments, guys, what is your favorite holiday? I really like all the holidays uh, because of all the vacations from school, but I definitely like Christmas and Thanksgiving. I think it's just a great time of the year, especially with snow coming. And it's always pretty exciting here. Now, we have a lot of snow to push here. I mean, a pretty decent amount of piles as well. And we'll have to just kind of do little by little to get this entrance cleared. But we'll just push it on over. Oh, yeah, no problem. The TOX doing it. No problem. Wow, a lot of snow. We definitely only four to five inches. And it kind of seems to be fluffy as well. But uh, when we get that slush, that heavy, wet snow, that is when uh, we have our work cut out for ourselves. And we're good to go here on the motel. So I think we'll head on over to another residential that's next door to our house. And then we'll head into the dining room table. Sliding all over the place here. Definitely needs to go out and uh, put salt down. But I think with the holidays, we won't be doing anything here. But that's good, though, that we are getting all of these driveways plowed out here. We're actually right next to our house. We'll just do our neighbors really quickly. It looks like they didn't come out and shovel. We'll just be good neighbors and help them out here. Now, snow plowing takes only a few minutes. But to shovel this, this takes probably half hour to 45 minutes. So we're really helping them out. And they have a lot less shoveling to do. That's something just kind of a neighborly thing I do try to do here. Now, I am thinking of doing some real-life snow blowing videos shoveling videos this winter once I do get some snow I did get a little bit of snow uh, but we definitely need more here but um, another pass through to the TOX looks like we're running pretty low on diesel though a full tank of gas already wow diesel is really expensive as well I think it's almost four dollars a gallon but uh, we're in business to make a lot of money pushing snow and it does put a lot of wear and tear on the truck but there we have it guys, our snow plowing is done here for today. We are right next to our house, so I think we'll just kind of bit, uh, get backed in the driveway and call it a day. But definitely we'll be uh, doing a lot more snow plowing on the Xbox, a lot more videos on the Xbox in general. And I am looking at getting that brand new Xbox as well. But hope you guys enjoyed today's video here, snow plowing on Thanksgiving Day. I really do appreciate all of your support. Have a great Thanksgiving. Thanks for watching, stay tuned for next one, and subscribe for more.